And welcome back. I'm going to actually increase the campaign straight up to flat. Uh, and I will get the 10% move speed bonus for myself. Uh, I've let the game run on my end for about 3 or 4 hours just on the load screen. And by the looks, it's actually heavily increased uh, the way my computer runs with it. I don't know why, I don't know how, but 8 gigs of RAM is going to hold for a little while longer to me. Also, this is a lot of mountain bandits, and I kind of want to get rid of my army. Um, where's the closest, um, let's see, yes, this is the, uh, save file where we've, where we've actually been losing, okay, just had to check. I'm actually going to head straight back to Omar, Omar, yeah, Omar, uh, and this is what I'm going to do differently now. I used to, you know, um, from the last time I've played, I have a full army, but there's no point in having a full army at this point in the game. In fact, it's probably, it's actually weighing me down. Having 14k, that just ain't gonna work with me. So I'm literally just gonna dump everything. This is a waste of money having this many troops. Uh, in fact, it's a waste of money having troops in the first place because I don't have to pay companions. I'm gonna also get rid of a ton of the food I have uh, and see if I can keep that's good enough with me. Because I don't have to pay companions. So, to combat the idea of not paying companions and not, you know, murdering my companion here because I'm not paying him. Uh, 5,000, do I really want to put that on though? Because I'm trying to look for... It's half barding. I really kind of want it. I will keep this if I can get my other person here a horse. If I can't, I will. I can get them a horse. Good. Right. And you have a horse and you have a harness. If you have you have a sword and a shield, I kind of want to get you a bow. I forgot. Are you shit at bow or good at bow? This is gonna cut into my funds very hard. And there's two more people I can also get. I can get up to four companions, meaning I can have five people in my party, and that is a very very good. I don't want. I don't want these guys, even though they're green, and that's why I don't want them. Um, I actually would want to check on my character here, on her. I need to go to clan management, I'm pretty sure, to check her. Uh, is she good on bow? She is good at bow. Good. Okay, so let's go over here. She has a hundred in bow. That's better than me. Uh, we're, I mean, it's getting to the point where it's not really better than me, but what do I have for a bow? I have a step bow. I'll get her a step bow then, too. It's cheap. I'll also get her... To, I want piercing arrows myself, or do I have ranged? I have ranged. How much are piercing arrows? 4k. I'll splurge on myself. Um, and then I will get her some stacked bodkin arrows. Because I want to... I want to kind of just... I, I'm going to... It's going to cost me all my money to do this. But two people... And they have, and we have the, um, she gets the horse archer AI. So because of this, uh, I will be able to actually engage into looters easier. Not just engage into looters easier, might I add. I can also fight them easier. And by the looks, yes, actually leaving it on for... Oh, wait, no, what time? It's like 11 or 12 p.m. where I am. I've left it on for about five hours, just on the load screen. It's optimized itself pretty well. Charge! Of course, I'm also not getting into, like, a siege battle or anything. So... Where are they? They're over here. I, I went past them. But yeah, like this is this is way better than before. Like I'm not dying or anything in my uh, visuals. Like, why did it take for me to have the game open for five hours for it to start running good? Uh, I also just ran past the guy. Where is my other person? Is she like just from a, a distance? Okay, just just follow me around then. I actually want to say I'm going to do like running like this. Go full speed. 
I want to go full. I want to go as fast as I can go because it'll give me uh, bonuses towards riding le levels. Uh, it'll get rid of, and it also I think give me archery levels too. I want to get up to the point where I can use any bow on horseback because getting a fucking long bow on horseback would just be broken. Also, I'll run into him because the barding helps with uh, ram damage. I think. I'm out of arrows. And we know what being out of arrows does. Brings out the axe. Ow. Get out of here. Where is he? Where I saw someone. They're running? Is she after them over there? Up here. Look, like I just had to check where she was circling. But look at this. This is way better. You know, you know. He's probably gonna get away. Yeah. I saw the red arrow. Well, uh, and this right here is such a fast way to get influence because everyone will fight you. You have two people. You can take on like thirty enemies. It's one of the fastest, if not the best, ways of gaining just flat influence in the game right now, uh, at this early on, of course. I'm not I'm not uh, having the army to actually go around and fight other lords. Uh, not to mention, now I'm actually taking more damage. I wanted a little bit easier of a start, so I can't, I, I don't want to be yelled at too much about that. Uh, I don't care about capacity as soon as I get, I think I'm going to go buy like a pack mill or something. They're fairly cheap. Uh, plus food, fire, forests. So in, it'll actually be way better to be in forests now. Just note. Oh, Olik over here must have had his army starved away. Ooh. And, and that's the thing about this game, too, is uh, when you're on the winning side, like, if I were to set it to where... Uh, actually, I really want some, a, a lance or a spear or something. Uh, the thing is, is that like before, like if if you were if you were able to if you win one like major battle, you like the the nation will lose the entirety of the continent. Like, there's two isles over here. If we if we lost since we lost Varcheg and we lost like a couple of our armies at Varcheg, uh, every single one of our lords that were in that are back down to no troops at all. So I need to actually get my influence up there as fast as I can, which is why I'm doing this. I need to grab a few more companions to make this a little faster. Uh, in fact, what would be faster if I actually, um, if I didn't actually spend all like 15, if I just got 15, uh, there's a glitch again. If I got 15 people, Kill them all! and couch it. Uh, if I, the thing is, is if I got 15 people, yeah. If I got 15 uh, followers, this would be stupid because everything would run away. And that's why I only want like one or two followers. Couch it. Couch it, couch it, couch it, couch it. Hey, no. What hit me for fucking 69, or yeah, 36, a rock. Remember, I have character death on, so this is bad to actually take hits like that. Uh, we, in fact, we had Yolana die. I don't know how she got glitched. She, like, got glitched back in the game. So, like, I went to a city and she got put back in my party. I honestly think I should get rid of her because of that. And I'm gonna actually report that as a bug to the devs, because it's early access. It's bugs. Uh, I will report that to the devs as soon as I can. You know, I'm not gonna get rid of her. If it's a bug right now, I died. I, I didn't die, but I went down. And she can she can beat him. I trust Yolana. Maybe. I did give her a pretty shit bow, but she's got good arrows. Oh, oh damn, that's a headshot. Uh, but yeah, just having a defender or uh, um, a uh, army full of your own people 
is just stupid power. It's like a power play. Because you, you don't have to pay them anything. You pay them to start the fee at the beginning. And that's it. Let's go back to Omor. Uh, we don't want to go that way anyways because there's a ton of enemy armies. And right now, uh, I think it's only... Yeah, I can't fight right now. So it's only my follower that could fight. Which, she could win. One-handed beer. I need to keep the hacks. I only traded out for the um, lance because I feel like a lance right now for hunting people is a little bit better. I just need to thin them out and I kill the people with the rocks because I ran into the guy throwing the rock and that bashed my characters like skull in so hard. Uh, who is in here? No one that I want for a partner. Uh, and I... I got 15 gold for killing some looters. You know, I get I get gold for my mercenary contract. I want to. How close am I getting to clan tier two? I am 100. I'm 17 off of clan tier two. As soon as I hit clan tier two, I can swear fealty, and uh, to the uh, Omor or the, the to the, the Sturgeons. Which I don't think I'll do. I think I'll just keep staying. Um, I I really want to swear fealty to the Sturgeons and help them get back that skit that uh castle. But I what I probably will do is just stay a mercenary, help them get back Varcheg, and kind of just roam around a bit. I don't, I also, uh, I also don't want to wait till I'm at 100% health, but I think it's best I wait till I'm at 100% health. But I think what I'll do for now is I'll go and help Sturgia get back Varcheg, because I don't want a faction to just get knocked out of the game. Uh, I feel like that on year two is just stupid. Uh, two years and one entire faction is already gone. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do that. So anyway, also I've just noticed that uh, influence here is just since I'm a mercenary, it's just slowly turned into gold. I remember noticing that a bit ago. This was gonna go pretty easily. Uh, I probably should go into the forest because I actually gain food when you're in the forest by yourself. I'm pretty sure, and this is it's. No, it's minus 0.5 when you're by yourself. So you don't lose for, um, a food when you're in a forest by yourself. Anyways, I don't think I'm going to do the lance right away because they pelted me with stones a little too hard. I want to try to waste their ammo. Uh, and lances are going to be good in later on battles. Uh, or, honestly, the lance would actually just be good. Uh, did I accidentally grab... I got like a group... Of, I got the village in on this. Shite. Alright, where are they? Also, I noticed that if I hold alt, uh, the indicator pops up where the enemy are, so I don't have to be like, oh, where are they? Uh, that's half barding's actually really helping my horse out. See, they're classified as spearmen? Oh, they got rocks. Are they any more, are they more accurate now that I, um, buff their damage? Not really. Not fair enough. I guess accuracy would be a bit bullshit if I if they had accuracy that'd be a bit bullshit. Also, those those uh, militia there are gonna tear them apart. I was getting shot at. I think I was getting shot at by her. Oh, I'm now 76 and bull. Mm. That sucks. Because I had that group join in with me. I actually didn't get enough, like, that much renown. I'm not going to get that much loot. I'm not going to get any prisoners. Because I had the uh, village join with me. Ah, uh, that sucks. Ah. Uh, just freaking loot ripped out of my hands because of that. 37 looters. Do you think I can do it? Uh, what's my inventory? Do I have a second set of arrows? If I had a second set of arrows in my inventory, I'd swap the, sh the, uh, the shield out for another set of arrows. I don't think I can do it with the arrows I have right now. At least easily. I don't think I can do it easily with the arrows I have right now. Also, how many stones do you get in a stone bag? Like, do these guys just have infinite stones? I, I don't think I'll be able to kill them right now. It's 37 is a little bit too much for just... Uh, my arrow supply. Oh, 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 oh. That's the one thing. See, since we lost our, uh, most of our people, uh, they're just going to go on and on uh, to completely destroy the Sturgeons here. 
I can deal with 17 looters. Uh, if I lead them out into a field, I can at least. Come on. Come on. Go this way. Because you're going to get scared away from that 19 group. Okay. Okay. Just make sure it's uh, in a field. There's gonna be a few trees here or there, most likely. Fight me if you dare. Yeah, I can see trees in the background. Uh, and we should win this. Uh, 17, if I put a single round into each of them, she could finish them off pretty well. Me! No! I'll put her over here. They are almost hitting me. Hit my horse. Headshots. I'm gonna get rid of the stone guys first. If I can get rid of stone guys, I can lance the rest easy. Stone guys are the scary ones. If you go too slow or you go forward or straight away from them. Here, scary. You're the last stone guy. You cut my horse. Oh, you cut my horse. You have a pitchfork. You need to die. You have a pitchfork. I don't like that. Oh, they hit me on the side. They hit my leg. 22. I don't think I have enough to do a couch, so I literally need to go like this. Hit my leg again. I need to hit, like, a solo one. That's so they can't, like, have me get hit by a second one. I got rid of the dangerous guy. He's got the, the pitchfork guy. I'm not. I just noticed my character is not skilled at all in full arms, so this is gonna help a lot. This guy. Right, and then solo man over here. I right, run away for a little bit. She should be kind of low on arrows now. Must stay. I guess a cheat. Yep, she's out of arrows now. There we go. So couching your lance isn't good unless you're guaranteed to hit them because when you actually use your spear, you can, I guess, hit them a little farther away. That's good to know. Also, it's really good to know that she is just fucking broken. Like, her stats, I was looking at them. Uh, or I didn't go in depth on them, but her stats are like way better than mine. And it's kind of depressing. Uh, honestly, hunting five looters, not worth my time. Of the three people I just got, let's go to the tavern. This is mostly what this game's going to be early on. Uh, I'm just going to get rid of the uh, axe. I can buy one back later. There are a couple hundred. Wait a little bit. Heal up that little bit of time and go back out. So Someone made an army over here. Uh, that's way out of my way. Not worth it. I want to come over here because I hear I hear a siege. Fafin. And the question is, is this worth getting into? Also, I want to check to see if I got anything else. Um, engineering would be building and operating siege engines. Okay. Uh, I kind of want to put stuff into... Uh, what do I want to put one into? One into, one into, one into. I think, I think one into leadership would be good. Uh, because of the XP bonus, or maybe the medium XP bonus per day to tier 1, 2, and 3 troops. That would be very nice. But I feel like the best idea would be...
I don't want to do this right now because uh, this does increase the loaning, uh, the learning rate. But I feel like actually going into riding would help because of the spare arrows and then, you know, sharpshooter and even, heck, even a mounted archer. That's like really good. Uh, I'm, I don't think I want to join up on these guys. I would be an extra, if I full loaded my party out, I would be an extra uh, 49 troops. But I don't feel like I would help out that much. Because 49 is still only... They're only sitting at uh, 300 then. And the castle's garrison is 540. So we are just fine here. Uh, they'll, win the, they'll win the siege. I don't have to worry about the siege. Um, and my food isn't really going down because of my skill. Oh, eight looters. That's a decent amount. Uh, I'd rather not fight you in the woods, but I will. Especially since I'm trying to train up my pole arms right now. Uh, especially since... Actually, this lance is pretty powerful. Oh, they have a guy with a spear. Never mind. Anyone with spears will die instantly because they have an ability. If they have spears up and they hit the front of your horse, your horse just insta-stops and rears up. And, you know, you might as well just get going instantly. Uh, you see them already? I see them already. Oh, hey. Where's Spear Guy? There's Spear Guy. There's Pitchfork Guy. That's not a Spear Spear. Okay, fair enough. Pitchforks are... A pitchfork is technically something that can stop my horse. So... Killing him is imperative. Also, anyone with rocks. Oh, shit. Rock guy is down. I actually didn't see him. I just swung because I heard someone. Okay, is that another rock guy? I think that was another guy with a rock. I heard an arrow. That wasn't a rock. Okay. Oh, the arrow was her. Ooh, I don't like taking damage because it takes so. It takes, I think, like literally ten ticks to heal that damage back. Because I only I heal by two, don't I? Yeah, I only heal by two. I mean, it takes. 15, 20 ticks to heal that back. We both hit the tree almost. Oh, he hit the tree. I almost hit the tree. Let's see what I can do about this guy then. You're the last one. Complete the mission. Oh, he got knocked out. He didn't even die. Yeah, I hit his stomach. Uh, I did... Uh, Oh, good chunk of damage. Uh, and he was actually uh, had enough armor to block 10 of the damage that I was supposed to do. So I did 10 less damage than I was supposed to do. There's 11 looters. Okay, I want to fight you guys, but not over here. I want to fight you over here. Please, hey, hey, come on, come on. I want to fight you, but not in the woods. 11, not in the woods. I'd rather just deal with them out in the open. Fight me if you can. Don't tell me this is a pass. I think this is the mountain pass map. I don't like this map. Please don't tell me this is the mountain pass map. Nope, it's the same open field map. I actually really like this map. This is a perfect map. Like, it makes sense that almost every map's this map. Ah, oh, oh, okay. Yep, fair enough. This is why I'm supposed to just kind of skirmish. Where's Rock Guy? There's Rock Boys. Yeah, because you're now more of a threat than anyone else. I have to shoot you guys. Before, it was like, you're just an annoyance. Now, it's, you're deadly. Well, you bastard. I saw what you did there. You hit my horse. Oh, you didn't. But the other guy did. Alright, since they're more or less spread out, I'm gonna go.
Okay, so I hit it for 34, but it blocked 12 of the damage. Oh! <laughs> Extra damage from perks! What? Oh, but that headshot. Oh, God. Visceral. Alright, come on, turn on me, turn on me, turn on me. Come on back here, me. I missed. Ninety. Oh, he hit me for twenty-three. The guy to my left hit me for twenty-three. Uh, this guy with blunt. Uh, the hammer buoyed. This guy actually hit my uh, abdomen. I don't know how. How did you hit? Oh, I bet you. I know. He swung, and it just went past my shield, like at the back. Like he had this angle at me, and my shield is like right here. Uh, up to about here, and he hit me at this angle. Okay, fair enough. But she'll win. Yep. And he's dead. Oh, he even got the horse. Ooh. I should have just used my arrows more. Thin them out. They can't be they can't be too close together or else I get uh destroyed like that. Oh well. Uh, I mean all I really have to do now is just No no not the Smithy. I didn't mean to go to the Smithy. Uh the Smithy, if you go in here and you have um blueprints and stuff, you can make a sword. Like right now I only have tier one blueprints, right? Uh one single tier one blueprint might I add. For everything. Like for this, 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 and this. And so I can only make this sword. Which requires one crude iron, one r four wrought iron, one hardwood, and one charcoal. And it requires a smithing of 40. So, that's something you can't do for a while. I mean, it's not that it requires a smithy of 40. You, you can probably do it with less than the uh, smithy of 40. Oh, yeah, I want to sit in here for a bit. But the thing is, is that... Um, A smithy of 40, I uh, will guarantee you have a decent weapon. Uh, yep, see, as you can see, I'm not spending anything for having um, the girl in my party. Not a dime. And I'm actually going to wait until I'm full healed. Uh, just to be safe, not not to be like anything uh, worryful, just to be safe. And the music of this game is really nice. I can't wait for it to uh, get some more features where you can actually take over a kingdom and start your own. Uh, right now you can't do that. Um, I wish they would also add a kind of a, a feature that would be like you can just marry, but the beginning of the game with your first character, if you're having troubles with being, uh, as the game goes on, of course, if you're having troubles actually getting into groups and marrying, uh, let's say like any other nobles, you could just marry a commoner, uh, just so you can continue the bloodline. I feel like that's something that would be a good idea to do, is give the option to do this. I'm not going to fight the 37, I actually need people to fight the 37. Uh, I feel like if I had a group of five companions, I could fight the 37. Because they would all be um, first archers and stuff. Uh, I'm actually going to go over here. I think there's um, there should be mountain bandits over here. Because there's a mountain bandit hideout. Okay. Have we gotten... We've not we've even we even lost the castle what's in it what's in it 51 people in it i know i know um i might be able to siege this down if i actually get people uh yorg there could get it right now actually i feel like i'm gonna join the army wait a minute People are leaving Sturgia because we're not able to hold enough uh, land for them. Uh, so what I'm going to do... 
Oh, we're not, able, we're not able to afford to give them land. Is what it is. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go around here. I don't care where I am. But I'm going to recruit what I can. Uh, nope, actually. I will... S I will stick in Britannia. And I'm just going to recruit as many people as I can. This has already been... Both of those were looted? Oh my god. That one's been looted too. How's Chornoboss? Has Chornoboss been looted? No. Thank god. Recruit who I can. Uh, anyone really. Let's try to get some help to the army. I, can if I can't really afford this. But... Yeah, like, they're, they're, everything's gone because it's literally all the lords have been going around and recruiting everyone they can. This will just have to do for a while. I have to go back to the steam by food now. Yeah, the lords have been just, just mass recruiting anyone they can. Oof. Alright, let's get over to, um... I mean, we can fight this guy then, if you want. But yeah, we'll, we'll get enough people to fight this guy then. Yeah! Hell yeah. Ariada! I am Archon of the Empire. They know your name, I'm a valiant warrior, and hoping you're on mercy matches. You know we are at war, surrender or die. Like, I don't care. I know that this girl really likes me. I believe this is the girl that really likes me. Um, this should be a good spot to actually uh, show off. Some stuff. I'm going to just set everyone to follow me. And I'm just going to kind of kite around a little bit. Because we have both, all three uh, armies on our side. This will be a good test for my ram. And this is a good, this is a really good test to show you that. Yeah, my RAM's a bit clunky still. Yeah, 8 gigs of RAM on a computer. Uh, not very smart these days, is it? Attack! Ah, whatever. Just have everyone charge. They're right there anyways. I'll uh, bring out the axe. And, or the, the spear. The lance spear. And I will actually... 82. So I'm actually going to just block this. See what I can do about these guys over here in our lines. Can I catch him? Will my computer let me to catch him? I don't think my computer will let me catch him. Ow. Oh, he hit me for 23 and I hit him for zero because I hit his horse. So fuck that horse. I don't want to kill it because it draw it doesn't it stops the loot then, actually, don't I? Is he gonna run away or what? I have couch little hands. <laughs> you fight, yeah, fight me, boy. Fight me. Couch it when you can. Couch this thing. That's the Lord right there. I actually feel bad for knocking her out all the time. How am I gonna? How are we gonna do this? Okay. How many more is there? How far away from the border is there? Because, like, we need to wipe these guys. The, Empire, the Valandians have way too many people. I can't hit them because of how close they are. So, uh, how s oh! <laughs> oh, that was, that was a good hit, whoever this was. I think that's one of the other lords. Nope. 
That went pretty well. We lost nine people. They lost everyone. I'm going to let her go, though. Like, it's smart to keep the Lord. But if I get the option, I'm going to let her go. Also, I'm going to grab everything I can. I feel like this... I felt like this was going to be a little bit better. But uh, what, do I, what am I to know? Uh, and they have nothing better. They also didn't let me keep it because I'm not the one who contributed the most. Why isn't everyone coming to help out the army? I don't know. I feel like they just fought. The other army. Is that 22 mountain bandits attacking me? Or that was 18 mountain bandits attacking 22 people? Okay. Um, that's actually kind of surprising. Attacking 22 people. I guess mountain bandits are kind of like tier 2. Because if, if you count looters as tier 1, mountain bandits are tier 2. Have to be. With me! I'm out. I'm going to actually do 2. Put my archers there. Put my footmen here. Infantry! And put you over there. Well, actually, you can come up here. So we have you guys here. You guys here. You can actually charge, I don't give a shit at this point anymore. And I can actually run these guys down now. So I'm actually just going to kill the hell out of that horse. The other highway, man. Did you get the horse? I think I got the horse. Is he gonna just keep running away? He's gonna turn. Which way is he gonna turn, even actually? I'll let him. Are you over there? I missed. I'm gonna get this guy first because he's farther away. Or farther closer to the border. And because I'll get a charge bonus on this guy, this will be doing the dirty. There we go. I don't care about the others. I lost two recruits. That's just fine by me, as long as I didn't lose anyone of the higher tier units. I'm surprised that twenty uh, eighteen mountain banners decided to actually attack or That's kind of surprising. I'll take all of that. I want to search any recruits to go into warriors. I want to fill up the unit ranks of the army that we have over there with a little bit better quality infantry. Not archers, because archers just get nuked. Just infantry. Also, this is way better than what I have for health. I only lose two speed and three uh, maneuverability for f 80 health and four charge damage. I don't have the riding, but I don't care. I'm probably going to sell it anyways. It's just something I'll do. Do these guys, I was going to say, if these guys are not burnt out anymore, do they give uh, Vlandian or uh, Sturgeon? Okay, so they're fighting a caravan. I'm going to recruit who I can here, and then I'll come to help attack the caravan, or not. But that's the thing, though, is like, we have, like, this army is cursed, like, destroyed completely. And I don't know, like, I can't do much about it. These are, like, Imperials, right? These are Imperial uh, recruits and stuff that want to join my army. I'm not. I'm going to recruit the uh, Imperial guys, but not, like, the Brigands and stuff. I feel like me being in this army is a lot worse than me being in this army. It's a literal three-person difference. 
but Hoff in here is probably a little bit better. I'm not going to fight that. I'm going to send my people in. Hopefully I don't lose anyone too important. If I do, well, good. It's money saved on my part. I don't have as much right now as I normally would. They're probably going to say thank you for coming to our rescue or, yeah. And then I'll grab a couple of prisoners. Upgrade. I won't upgrade anyone except for the recruits. And the woodsmen will turn into brigands. Because brigands come with a shield. Uh, I will also recruit as many of those people as I can. Uh, neither of those are as good as what I can have or what I have on. I didn't want to raid. Hello. I'm just here to help Hoffman. Whatever, we're gonna we're gonna raid it, so Yeah, I this is this is it tells me right here is what I get, not what we get out of it. I've raided a village before, and you get a ton of stuff. Like if it's a grain village, you're gonna get like fifty to a hundred you're gonna get fifty to a hundred grain. I think this is a flax village. I don't know. There's just something in the air about flax that I just I don't I don't know. Is this a flax village? It doesn't let me know. Oh wait, it is. So he we're literally just gonna raid the villages that used to be ours. Because we don't have a big enough army. And I'm just going to keep sending uh, my own troops because I'm hoping that they die. But they're not dying. Not too happy about that. Ooh. No, I would rather have the the uh, leather tabard. Now we're going to go to Kranarog. Will the... Um, no, but I can get another uh, archer. These are militias, so no. Warrior can go to soldier. Recruits can go to warrior. That's the only thing I'll upgrade is recruit to warrior. Also, I noticed that if I shrink this, it tells me how much my daily wages are. My view distance. And my party speed. Alright. So, everyone's going to start hating us because we're raiding these villages. I'm just sending my army to try and get people killed, and one died. Uh, oh no, a warrior. Uh, people are going to hate us for doing this. I don't care. They get another warrior. I think it's three more warriors to replace the ones they lost. Uh, and nothing here is better than what I have. So, oh, except for that axe is better than the axe I used to have. Also, because I sold my axe, it doesn't matter. Uh, what the fuck? We just killed the people and ran away? Is it because the army doesn't have much food? I don't think it's. I think it's because the army doesn't have much food. Never mind. We're going to go back. Question mark. Was there like someone with a bunch of uh, troops around or something? I don't get it. Anyway, I'm getting points in roguery, and um, this is also giving me exp. Except I don't think this village has anything in it. Like no joke, I'm getting nothing. I also have no food. Give me, like, grain. This should be, like, a grain or a flax village. Come on. I can't tell. It gave me nothing. Alright, because my party's starving, I have to, like, just bolt straight to Kranarog. And also, because of how, like, bad my allies are doing in terms of this war, I need to not only buy as much, uh, I think I've just overloaded the, uh, merchant. I'll buy all your furs, too. I need to run over to an actual, like, city. 
Oh, we, we've lost everything. Like, what is up to Vlandians? Like, no joke. Like, what is with the Vlandians? Also, where's that 37 stack of looters? Alright, well, let's go sell the prisoners. Let's go to trade and sell the furs. I swear they're not going to net me... Yeah, they're not going to net me any profit. Uh, whatever. Um, I'm going to go into my party. I don't feel like the Sturgeons are going to win. I, I don't know why, but it just doesn't feel like they're going to win. Like, they have no troops. Everything's, like, taxed out on troops. And when they leave their buildings now with, like, 12 people, they're getting destroyed by f f the damn, uh... There's 36 looters. I'll go over to the 36 looters. They should come at me. No, okay. Uh, but the thing is, like, every, they, like, where's, where's all their people? They're not nowhere near me. Like, we've lost half our land just about. I know I can, I know, like, I can help them come back from it, but it's just kind of sad to see the AI lose so badly. Like, when there's a 700 versus 700 and both get stacked... Stack wipe. The the enemy just recovered a lot better than we did. Out! Bowman! 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 So I'm actually gonna set my people up like this. Here's the Vargs. If I can aim. See how far away the map border is. How far away is the map border? Like, Jesus. I feel like the game thinks the enemy is going to unroute, so it makes a little bit bigger, they've made a little bit bigger maps. Uh, m mainly because what it is, is what they, what they, what, what it is, is they want, uh, they have a certain set of maps, certain rotation of maps that they have. That's, it's going, that it's going to be played on a lot more than others, because there's, um, a larger group of enemy, or allies, or something like that, stuff like that, right? There's, yeah, this has just been raided. So, we actually have lost everything up here. Uh, the funny part is the Vlandians actually have to walk through the Batanians land to come here, and Varcheg is the front. The Vlandians are, I think, the most powerful. They're at war with both us and, oh god, they're also at war with the Empire. Uh, but that's part of the Empire got wiped. The Batanians are also just wiping the Empire out like it's nothing. Because uh, now there's only the... Um, I think this is the, uh, the Southern and then the West Northern. There's no Western Empire anymore. Oh, God. And we are, we're down to four, f four capital cities. 
the Vlandians have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh God! And then the, they're fairly high too. It's it's just a it's not good right now. I feel like the Vlandians are a bit overtuned in terms of their early, early game, but that could just be me because I'm playing uh, the, the Sturgeons. Twenty-four looters. I kind of want to fight that. I wonder what would happen if I just said just sent my men at them. In fact, because I want to know, I, I really want to know what would happen. I'm just going to send my men at them. I feel like my troops would just utterly dominate. And that's exactly what they did. They all got knocked out, but they utterly dominated. Works with me, though, still. Has... We're gonna, we're probably gonna lose. No joke. The Sturgeons are probably gonna lose. So, um, I'll do what I can. And what I'm gonna do is probably resell my army. I spent all my money. I'm gonna just resell my army. Because what is this army getting me? But nothing is literally just getting me nothing I want to keep both of those <sighs> yeah it's, it's just getting it's getting me nothing having an army like this is gonna get me nothing so I'm gonna get rid of them There's no point in ha the honestly in like in this game. There's no point in having an army. In fact, I'm gonna quick check the tavern see if there's anyone else that I might want. I didn't want to enter the smithy. Sorry, game. Like, is everyone like going way back here to get new troops or something? Cause I know up up here is just out of just out of everything. Because troops reset daily. Troops reset daily, so... Yeah. Charge! Normally I like grouping the people up. Oh, he's got a he's got a he's got a rock. He's got a rock and a and a makeshift spear. Get him out of it. Get him out now. Spear guy there. That's not spear guy. That's spear guy right there. Oh come on. Oh what the. What are these misses? No. Your guy separated himself. Yes, it is time. No, it's not time. Yeah, see? I can't even hit him. I wasn't paying attention. That's bad. Alright, we'll separate yourselves, guys. the armor on the mount though. I would be able to do any of this if I didn't have the extra barding. Because like that helps so much on damage. Don't you that pitchfork guy like screw that pitchfork guy. Yes. Yes. Good shot girl. Also, 61 blunt. Are you okay, horse? You okay? You don't look so good. I don't care. 
Uh, it should have given me a good chunk of uh, uh, renown and stuff. Uh, as long as I can hit tier 2 of my clan soon, that'll be good. Because when I finally am able to actually become part of the faction, I can start doing things that are actually important. I hit tier 2. I need to find the kingdom's leader. Where is he? I know he is probably hiding in the fucking corner somewhere. Uh, Sturgeon is taken prisoner by the Vlandians. See? Hiding in the corner somewhere. Oh! Can I beat 27? I can beat 27. So, he's a prisoner of the Vlandians. Maybe. Said spring 2nd. So, on the 2nd of spring, he was turned into a prisoner. I wonder if he's gotten out yet. I wonder. Did you hit someone? I can't tell if you hit someone or not. Cut them down. I actually can't afford to miss. I can't fight that. In fact, I'm literally just gonna kind of chill off. Ooh. How am I looking on bloodied character? I'm not really bloodied. I guess it's all been blunt damage, huh? It's all been blunt damage then. And plus, because I have that reach, like, I can poke them out of their range. Nope, I can't poke them that slow. Uh, they also got the other person, didn't they? Yeah, they got her. Her horse is right there. They got her. I think she charged in with her sword. Uh, that sucks. Um, cause I won't, when I get out of the looter's army, I won't get out of the army with her. Uh, and, yeah, that was captured, Yolanda was captured, blah, blah, blah. I should have just left. 27 is still a monumental task for two people. If I had extra arrows, it wouldn't have been as bad. If I didn't risk it, it wouldn't have been as bad. What she did is she ran into them all with the soul, uh, sword. Whatever. I'll just I'll stay in captivity. It doesn't matter to me. I'm paying no one any fees. And what I do is I will uh, most likely just get out. As shown there. And then I'll attack them. And 
they win. Anyway, I've lost uh, Yolana. She won't even rejoin my party after I find a city like this. Maybe she's in the tavern. That's sad. Uh, well, I might as well start to sell the stuff I have on me then. Uh, get some food. Let's go see what I can get from uh, Epicrotia. Who's in the tavern? I'll go to the tavern. There's three people there. Uh, if I can get two, that'll still be a monumental win. I probably only get like one. Uh, prices are kind of expensive for companions in this game. I think it, it was like 800 for Yolanda. Give or take. Where's the music? There it is. And it's also sound oriented towards the musician, too. So because he's right there, if I go over here, it's still coming right from him. You're, the, you're cursed, your Imperial Arms Trader. Yes. There's a ransom broker, there's just a townsman, there's a townsman. Townswoman, townsman. Empire townswoman. There's Eddie and the healer. Coming by yourself. Healing. Generation, generation services. And accomplished herbs. Extremely poor, well richly robed. Both have men with half of our skill. Walk to him towns leading to the lords and ladies. Okay. Like you got a good, he, good head for business. Many healers come to specialize in diseases of the rich. You know something more than ours is spent on war than anything else. So someone raised an army and doesn't want to lose their investment to infect wounds and fevers. Well, it might be worth to employ me. Right now, I'm between jobs. You got any work for me? I'm willing to discuss. I can use like someone in you. Uh, 1400. Okay. I'll hold back for you. Uh, I'll talk to Miss Accursed. You're born with a birth mark on my shoulder in shape of an eye. Whenever I pass my nearest street, they made the sign of the protector at me. They're going to blame me for the thing that's children and livestock. The man of my father drive me out of the village. So it's four to fourth girls. There's no great loss for him to comply. Probably saying worry over he was going to find money to marry me off. I have my mother screamed and wept, and my opinions were of no consequence. Wanted village, village, begging and stealing. Flared at the mercy. At, yeah, their mercy of the robbers. Road to the fear of the evil eyes, and they do the man's loss. Uh, I learned to protect myself, and the body of one's careless bandit afforded me with my first sword and leather jerkin. Sad tale, please continue. That's all there really is. Still have a sword, and it's for hire. So those will pay well. How much? 700, I'll take it. Uh, 700 isn't much. Also, my music has stopped. You bastard. There is another person in here, and I don't know where. You. I don't care about yours. The lady's got a reputation to be a man of the men. Another 700? Okay, so that's 1400 for two. I probably will take... Yep. I feel like I'm not going to get the other, the third one, the healer. I don't think I can afford it right now. He's doing pretty good with that song, though, I admit. Like, you damn bastard, you could give me another one. He started another one. And 
that's so good. Yeah, I didn't have enough money for her. Honestly, these other two people are also just going to get in the way in the beginning. Because I don't have horses or anything for them. So, let's go. I heard fighting over here. I think something just happened over there. Ice! That us that, th that symbol usually lends something's being seized or taken. Uh, Sturgeons declared war on the Batanians. No, that's stupid. Yeah, yeah, we're losing to the Vlandians. Why not declare war on the Batanians while we're at it? Oh, God. On them! Now! Yeah, okay, well, you, while you guys fight, I'm just going to be over here. Game. <laughs> Okay, yeah, fair enough. I think one of them died. It says one of them died. Uh, uh great. I've already lost seven hundred dollar investment, huh? I think all of here is being raided. Oh, we got lucky there, too. I wasn't paying attention. Uh, what's in my party? Uh, she is alive. Oh, God. Uh, I will actually go to character. Oh, I don't see anything on me. And then... When will Yolana come back? Where's clan? Sionson. Sionson. Where's Sionson? Oh no, no. We just declared war on the Britannians, too. Oh, uh, we're also losing to the Vlandians? Sturdy is just going to get themselves killed. Like, we're going to lose everything. Oh, well. Where's the fun in getting a faction that's steamrolling? Does, you don't even have arm wraps. You don't have a uh, cloak. Okay, let's try to get these people something then. What do we got for shields? What do we got for shields? Cheap. Reset. Okay. So where's the cheapest shield? Over here. I want two. Thank you. I'm going to go to inventory. And I'll give each of them a shield. 
Now they are semi-sufficient. Oh god. Everyone's up. Let's go find some bandits. So she's we're we've basically I feel like someone's sieging the city down. This is the Empire. The Empire declared war on Britannia, huh? Is that why we declared war on the Britannia? Can we get Yolanda to come over here? Like, oh, oh, she's devious, but she's generous. She's close-fisted, but she's honest, daring, and merciful. And then she's daring, and I have no traits. So, I feel like I need I need to go hunt down like smaller groups of looters to kind of recoup. I have both of them being useless still. Seriously. Useless. Probably should check to make sure they had full health instead of like 30%, because they probably only had 30%. Anyways, I'm gonna run back through the forest and we're probably gonna get ambushed by a shit ton of looters. Something. Because, um, and also, also, uh, the thing is with like all these things is they have to retrain every, all, all the troops that they just lost. Meaning that if they had a ton of high tier, uh, units, they've lost all their high tier units. Um, and yeah, I think I think it's because my companions here are fairly shit right now. So I'm gonna have to go. S I'm just gonna go sit in Omar for a bit because they aren't on horses with the bows. They're gonna get just beat around a bit. So how, how this is a 179 militia with a 330 garrison. So it'll require just over 500 people to f take it, right? Oh, you would expect. I might actually restart because of how hard Vlandy is going on the uh, people here. And if I do, I will skip straight to um, basically the point I'm at now. I'll skip straight in as far as I can. So I can get the best showcase of playing the game again uh, because what I'm doing right here is just hunting out a ton of looters and stuff I will actually come f just help him and then send in my other two people who will probably get their asses handed to him no surprisingly not I got one gold out of that fight and no equipment yeah not to mention I bet I bet you all of the freaking people we were with are like running out of uh, money and stuff now so, because we're at war with the Britannians, I would love to go in on that. Also, I think this guy, the Mount Man, is actually going to go for me. Yeah, I can't run from him either. I don't have enough people on horseback. Hmm. 
Man, bandits are just generally not good people. Are they, do they, are they using their throwing spears? Yes. That's one down. Can I couch lance the other guy over here? I don't want to couch lance him. I'll be able to cash lines in most likely. Alright, because I'm going this fast, I can couch. Which way will he turn? You turn this way? Couch blast the horse. To the head. He's on their playing field now. But you know, I'll kill him. Because he will fuck them up. Other men are worth a lot. I don't care about what I'm going to get from this battle. Uh, it's not going to be too much. As shown, it's not going to be too much. Except that will actually work good for um, you. I'll give you javelins. I'll sell this uh, really I'll sell this prisoner. Good price. Uh, and then I will sell the horse harness for a good price. So I'm actually gonna go over here and start hunting mountain bandits then. It's gonna be that way, I'll just some mountain bandits. Or looters, you know, either one. Ay, 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 ay. I think my faction lost one big battle, and then it just downward spiraled from there. And by loss, I mean, we didn't really even lose, lose. We just... Have fumbled. In fact, we actually won the fight. The thing is, is that we didn't lose this one of the uh, sieges, or yeah, we didn't lose, we didn't win a siege. <laughs> There's Rama for two damage, charge bonus. He's dead. Sixty-nine. Knocked her out. She's gonna get double teamed to death. I actually got her. Fair enough. I didn't mean to hit her. She would have been knocked out anyways if she had only 20 health. I would have killed her no matter what health she was on any as well. Like... That's the one thing. Okay, these are there's nothing they can use. Um, we're down to back to one. I'm surprised we got Krana Kranarog Castle back. And I'm surprised we've kept Omor. It's probably because the Batanians right now are focused on killing the Empire, which just took this castle from them. So... What I'm gonna do... What am I gonna do? I don't know what I'm gonna do. I feel like just getting companions for an army is the best bet. So it's one of, oh my god, one of us just got captured again. Where's the kingdom lead, by the way? Regald. Or Bagard. Balgard. Oh god, Balgard. I hope there's no, like, stack of, like, 15 on the bridge here. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head over here and ask to be a vassal. I don't think he's in there. 
Oh, he's in there. Should be one more person. In the mirror. Is that a guy or a girl? Couldn't tell from that distance. I know, um... That's a girl and this is a guy. Yeah, yeah, I wish I could be more than a mercenary. Could I be a vassal? I am ready. I swear homage. You shield people against wolves, forest, the steppes, and the sea. I give you my word, my bond. Stand by your banner and battle song. Let breath remains. And uphold your rights under the laws of Sturgeons. And the rights of your king. And to avenge their blood as if it were my own. You have been given me your solemn oath. I will you hold it properly with proper courage and devotion. Next to me is sworn follow. You shall have the warrior's due. The warmth of my hearth fire and the bread of my fields. The gold of your valor. I shall uphold your rights under the laws of Sturgeons and avenge your blood if you fall. You have done a wise thing. Serve me well and I will promise you a scythe. I think this is his wife. It is a long yard for my clan. It's starting already. It's too quite miserly. Who wants to learn from you? What do you say? You've been taking on your wing for a while. Let's say 200 days. Uh, feed and protect him. Don't treat him like any of your companions. Let him stay with you for a year and then let him return to us. I'll send him a worthwhile gift and perhaps more valuable. You will gain my life on friendship. Assuming everything goes well. Okay. Lad needs a tutor. A lady needs a tutor. A lad needs a tutor. Oh, she's got another quest, I think. I think I'll stick with the one quest I'm doing right now, though. Uh, keep a guy alive for 200 days. So, what I'm hearing is quite literally give him... Just, just stick him on, like, his own control group and tell him to go sit in the corner of the map. Who did I get, then? Ah, oh, motherfucker, Mimir. Okay. That guy probably ain't gonna survive. Experience 60. Okay, so do, do I have to get him for like 60 battles then or something? I want to talk to you just to recruit you. Gandarina the Black. Or Gondarina the Black. Gandarina? Gondarina. 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 Uh, so you were... Okay. You're a pit fighter. I'll just pick you up. Because you're, you're another person. I just buy you a shield. Throw the shield on. You're just as useful as everyone else in my party right now. Literally. Uh, again, Gondarina. Get you a 55 cent shield. And boom. You're literally just as useful as everyone. I just got a 50. Oh. You are welcome. I thought that group right there just attacked me. But it was Mimir being. Oh, thank you for agreeing to train me. Uh, I'm looking for bandits. There's not going to be any bandits over here. Let's go back to uh, the castle over here. I need to take him into 60 battles in 200 days. So. Be prepared for the tra training regime of your life, Mimir. That caravan's probably going to help me. It didn't. Here's me hoping Mimir's on his own control group. God, I hope he acts like a fucking horse archer. Cut them down! 
He is a horse archer, okay. That's good, that's good. Uh, game. Thank you. I probably should wait for a few seconds. Ah, uh, yeah, okay, fair enough. So he's gonna stick at, like, far range. Well, he shouldn't die. If he was like a normal unit, that would be a bit more scared. Let's just get rid of Pitchfork guy. See any other Pitchfork guys? Oh, there's that guy. I only got a Pitchfork though. I just kind of wanted to shoot him. Mimir, you're almost hitting me with your arrows. If he hits me with a fucking arrow and kills me, I'll be pissed. Like, I agree to train you, not get killed by you. Good luck. <laughs> no, he's too, he's he's pretty good. He's pretty good. I like him. I kind of like him. I think that bar of 60 is I need 60 battles, not just 60 XP. I need 60 battles with him. So I'm gonna go over to um, girl here. This is better for you. You don't have any arm wraps. Yeah, take the rest. Cordo more. And let's go check the party screen. Is it 60? No, he needs experience. I need him to upgrade skills 60 times. This is what it is then. Okay, so I just want to do this then. Did Mimir get knocked out? No. Nothing's there. It's good. Did he get any... He got an experience point for that one. Good. Thank God he's for free though, like seriously. Uh, I'm gonna just hunt down small little bands of people then. Uh, get the other couple people in my group, probably horses then too. Not fight that though. That that was 14 looters. Uh, that's 29 looters. We can't fight that. What can I do for horses, real quick? Just mule. Two desert horses is 500. You can get a you can get a horse and you can get a horse. What about then the horse armor down here? Uh, rugged desert saddle. You get a saddle. What can I do for bows then? Two step bows and then arrows. Two tournament arrows. You can have a bow. You can have an arrow. You can have a bow. You can have an arrow. Uh, and then you can get these javelins then. And that's literally all the money I've made multiple times, multiple runs now. Just spent trying to kit some people out a little bit better. I, ooh, 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 that's the group. That's a fight I want to go to.
So, you know, probably gonna get... Nope, no one was knocked out. That's actually kind of surprising. I'll grab three looters. People got injured a little bit. This. Ulrich versus Uric. Or Athenos versus Ulrich. First on horseback, let's kill that guy first. It's an Imperial Cataphract. This is the leader. I can't tell, and that is disconcerting me. Couchable. I was hoping he'd do like a five point turn so I could get a good hit on him. Last nugget, I don't think we have anyone left. There's a horse that's dead, and my game's not having fun. Where's that cataphract? It's right there still. So I'm actually going to shoot this guy then. I'm not gonna make it out of this one, most likely. There's too many people. That's actually kind of surprising that they're able to do that shot. I just noticed that guy point blanked me. I saw him way too late. Not to mention I got to the battle way too late. In fact, I lost someone. Don't tell me Mimir died. I think Mimir died. Like when we were dead. And he's going to instantly head back to Vartrig. Bop. And I will, I won't accept any offers to get out.
Uh, I think the Vlandi has just captured everyone. Is Mamir still in the party? I think Mamir's still in the party. Well, he's still alive, I should say. Not in the party. Kind of glad he's still alive, though. I have, a, I have a focus point, though. Oh, I need to be... I, I, I can't be, you know, stuck in a jail. Anyway, um, I think the Sturgeons are done for. They're just, they're just getting kicked in. In fact, we're probably going to lose Omar. Because we're at war with Britannia. And we're with the entire northern side of the map. No, and just note also, like these, those two people have to be like working together. Like no joke, they've 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 done too much. It's too late to like save the Sturgeons too. The Sturgeons declared war on the Britannians too now. Like it's too late to save the Sturgeons. I needed to increase my clans. Um, level prestige level up way faster so uh what i'm gonna do is actually uh i'm probably not gonna get out of this they're just gonna keep me in but what i need to do and this isn't fun oh i did get out um how for how long though and at what cost Like, oh, more over here can't be going too well anymore. Uh, I gotta check who else is here. Um, Balgard, Epicrotia, Baltakhan. Epicrotia is still there. Fawns and Balgard. Attack on. I don't know where that is. Up there. So we have to go to Epicrotia without getting killed. Get another one. Uh, just skirt around that army. Not worry about the people who are suiciding. And I will grab you. And let's go straight to Bulgard. Thank God I had that bookmarked. So this army's fucked. The Sturgeons are screwed. They literally just need to calm down. And I'm pretty sure the last one's still way off, and yes. What I don't like is where's Mimir? Where's Mimir?
Oh, yep, that we're losing. How well can you guys do? You guys can win. Good work. I'm actually kind of surprised that you guys won that. We're not going to win this. Like, that battle there is a loss. They're saging it because they can actually win. Pitchfork wine, sell everything. Scroll down, where's the food? I have like four fish. Did we come here? Yep, see, 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 done. They threw in 80 people. Man, this music is actually kind of like sad. Well, they all got whooped. Guess we're on too low of health. You deserve that shot. You hit my horse. You don't hit my horse. But I keep forgetting that I need to wait for like these to come down, so or else it'll go slower. I need to come to Omor. Uh, sell what I got. And wait for a bit for everyone to heal up. We're also running out of food here. Like, this city is out of food. It's losing its garrison. It's losing its militia. And it's losing its prosperity. So it's gonna, it's just going down. In fact, there's a siege going on over here. Ah, bugger. Um, yeah, I'll just surrender. Oh, the Vlandians and the Batanians are at war. So where are you going to take me? Are you going to take me all the way back to Batania? No way. No way. No, 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 no. This isn't good at all. Uh, 
I'll get out eventually. And by eventually, I mean never. They're gonna put me in Lagetta. And pop. This, this music actually kind of goes fitting with like the fall of an empire. The Sturgeons just gotten, the Sturgeons got beat down too hard. And they can't recover. I feel like they need to make it so that the AI has like a special recruitment zone. And that they can actually rebuild their uh, troops a little easier. Just a little bit. This is pretty bad. Like, you lose one battle, it's over for that entire empire. Like, they'll, they'll never recover. Nope, 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 no. no, no, no. Caravans don't attack. Villagers don't attack. Looters do. Caravans don't attack. I'm literally just betting my entire life that caravans don't attack. Also, yeah, there goes one more. I was wondering where I was going. So oh, oh, more. Oh, yeah, we've lost some more. I was wondering if a uh, bow guard was under siege. We have one person here. Where'd everyone else go? We have a Kratia, Elikus, and Omor. Omor. Oh God. So they go back to their starting spots. I feel like I literally just need to leave the kingdom. We've got literally nothing to do. We're just sitting here for a bit. The downfall of an empire. Oh, there's the king. I'll take it. Screw it. It's the best bet we got. And it ain't really a bet at all. Because we're not gonna win. Literally, no. S this is this can be beat by looters. This mm -hmm. army. I mean, not anymore. We're not gonna get away with this. Like, even if we get like we build the siege and stuff. I mean, get to the siege, we're not gonna win the siege. You know, I noticed that so many people have less Sturgia. It's kind of depressing. Also, I'm getting engineering skill, which is very, very good.
Oh, he decided to attack, okay. Oh, God. Just a battering ram. Alright, so I'm gonna let the game kind of handle itself for a second. Uh, when it loads in. Oh, God. I don't have the ability to um, rebuild my character or my group. Like, there's no ability to rebuild Sturgia. They 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 screwed themselves by declaring war on a second faction too. Okay, 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 okay. All right, game. I have auto to play on because I'm not the lead. You forget that you have a lance sometimes. Also, uh, one of those guys right there is supposed to be who's pushing the battering ram. Instead of me. Uh, but I'll push it because it's about all that character's good for right now anyways. They'll all push rush towards, towards the wall. Um, we're probably going to lose the battering ram to, I think that's a mangol. Manganel. Nope. That is just a normal ballista. We can't shoot me just yet because it's a straight shot. It's also, I think, missing. That doesn't fill me with confidence. That really doesn't fill me with confidence. Uh. Oh boy. Oh, I saw him, Manganel. Oh, shite. I can take an error or two. I don't think I'll have to. Why don't you tell us that door of the, the door is hell? I'm gonna shoot this guy to death. And yeah, that guy got in my way, so I just shot him anyways. That guy's dead. Cruise off the ballista. Let's shoot all I can. The archer's here. They're the militia archers, so they're not, you know, it's not imperative that I kill them, but... An archer's an archer right now.
I think we got up on the walls. Well, that's good to know. Uh, where's the guy with an axe? I think my character's covered in blood. Yeah. I wonder why they didn't do that. Seems so like they use Manganel. So that's pretty good. I don't think I lost anyone. And I only had, let's just say it's two of me. They're probably gonna, if, if, if there's only the amount of Sturgeons I think there is left, this castle's gonna go to me. And I think there's literally only the amount of Sturgeons that are left. So the castle's probably gonna go to me. I don't know why, but I feel like this is just better than what she has on right now. That is for sure. We run away, 312. We literally just siege the castle to run across back to Belgard. We raided that for 40 people. We lost 40 people raiding this village. <sighs> Getting a bunch of points here and there. I'm getting nothing from this. Out of cheese. So I can't help them, uh, where the farms now? Back to off castle to besiege it. Oh my god, we're gonna... Yeah, screw you guys. I can see where everyone else has left the surgeons. Oh, and by the way, they were actually, they actually did get caught. They just said they were caught. Because I really want to be with the Sturgeons, I am going to actually um, restart my campaign. So I hope you enjoyed this a little bit. Um, I've been more or less just getting destroyed. Uh, I will restart the campaign, make a new character. I will probably change up their stats a bit. 
And so, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. This will be the end of this uh, set of three.